everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so today's video is a what i eat in a day well breastfeeding if you're new here on my channel i have a baby boy who is now nine months old my last what i eat in a day was well i was pregnant and i had gestational diabetes so yeah you can hear my baby boy Axel. He just woke up from his first nap and we're going to have some fruit right now. So yeah, I really hope you will enjoy this what I eat in a day. If you're excited, don't forget to give the huge thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe. I already have my breakfast, so I will share with you that right now. Um, I had two eggs, a few uh, sherry tomatoes and one slice of bread. And of course my coffee because I can't live without that. I'm giving my baby boy Axel some fruit and I always have some fruit as well and today I'm going to give him a little bit of banana and some cherries so I'm going to mix those together and then I'm having what's left of the banana and also some uh, cherries which are so delicious but the cherries are a bit sour so that's why I'm mixing the cherries and the banana together uh, for him so yeah I'm just having what's left of the banana and um, some cherries as well and I always have some fruit in the morning and um, he's crawling away so I'm going to catch him if you are wondering why i look like a sweaty mess in this video it's because we are currently in a heat wave in turkey it is like 40 42 degrees and in our home it's like 35 degrees which is like crazy hot so i'm currently in the living room with the air conditioning on Axel didn't eat anything and um, so I brought it here maybe he will eat it here because maybe it's just too hot in the kitchen right now so like I said I have some banana and um, some cherries and this is like a little snack that I always have in the um, morning so Axel's down for his second nap of the day and um, later I'm going to make some lunch for us both. I got some avocado so I'm going to give Axel some avocado and Turkish yogurt and I think I'm going to have some avocado on toast for lunch. And I just want to mention that um, I'm not eating healthy like every single day like... Um, if I'm very busy with Axel, I just grab something quick. But something that surprised me is that after I gave birth, um, I was just so, so hungry all the time. Maybe it was also about my gestational diabetes. If you saw my last what I eat in a day, you know that... Um, I had a very strict diet and the first month was very hard um, and that's maybe because I just didn't eat enough calories like I lost a lot of weight and um, Aksa was very hungry all the time and my milk was just not enough so we gave some extra formula but after I gave birth I started to eat everything again because with my uh, diet I didn't eat any sugars or carbs so after I gave birth I started to eat everything again so I think that helped with my milk support and um, I also gained some weight again um, so yeah I'm just eating everything again um, like I said I try to eat healthy but I'm definitely not eating healthy every single day like I love my biscuits and I also eat um, some chocolate every day but I really do try to eat a healthy breakfast lunch and dinner so um, that I have also enough vitamins in my body and what I'm also doing is drinking loads of water um, I always love to drink water but especially now in this heat wave and when I'm breastfeeding like I'm losing lots of liquids so I definitely need to drink loads of water and I guess I'm drinking like three liters every single day. So, yeah, so when Axel wakes up I'm going to make us some lunch. So Axel just woke up and I'm going to give him some Turkish yogurt and uh, some avocado and I'm also going to have some avocado on toast and some cherry tomato so that's what we are having for lunch today. And I saw this hack on internet that you can very easily get the avocado out. Let's see if this works. It actually works. Oh, that's alright. 
And I'm also giving Axel a little bit of cherry tomato in this fruit pacifier. So this is what I'm having for lunch. Two slices of whole wheat bread, some avocado and cherry tomatoes. And Axel is not eating very well today. I don't know what's wrong with him today. Um, he's just not hungry. I tried to give him some avocado and also some cherry tomatoes. But yeah, he's just not having it. I'm not sure why. We'll try again later, but you know, it's one of those days. But yes, I'm going to enjoy this now. So Axel just had a bath and he's watching Teletubbies. And I'm going to have some more cherries because I'm feeling very hungry again. So Axel's almost going down for his last nap of today. And I'm going to enjoy some biscuits. Really, these are the best. But yes, these are so good. These are from Etty and they're just delicious. If you are in Turkey or if you are visiting... <laughs> But yes, if you're living in Turkey or you're on holiday in Turkey, try these biscuits. They're the best. So I think life is all about balance. Like, I love these biscuits and Axel wants to play with them. But I also started working out since um, I was like eight months postpartum about one and a half months ago i started working out again and i do this really fun dance workout from grow with show and they're like super easy and beginner friendly so if you're looking for some nice workouts check out her channel i really enjoy doing them i'm not trying to lose any weight or anything like i'm just eating whatever i want like biscuits and um, i also love my crisps in the evening as well but just to make me feel like a little bit stronger again because while i was pregnant i was swimming like almost every single day and i felt really fit and now since axel's born like i just didn't do anything so i'm trying to do those workouts and i'm also walking every single day with axel so for dinner tonight I'm having mushwer and this is a Turkish dish. They're basically zucchini pancakes with some other vegetables in it. My mother-in-law made these the other day and they're so so good. Um, so I'm going to have this with some Turkish yogurt and some cherry tomatoes. So thanks to my mother-in-law I don't have to cook tonight. And this is so yummy. I will try to link a recipe down below and it's called mushwer again in Turkish. And then after my dinner, I always have like a little chocolate treat. And this is a Dido, which is basically like a huge Kit Kat. And this is so delicious. Again, if you are in Turkey, try this out. They have this with dark chocolate, white chocolate. And this is like a special gold one. So I just removed my makeup and put my PJs on. I'm going to bring Axel to his bed. And yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this, what I eat in a day. But I hope maybe it gave you some meal ideas. Um, yeah, and if you enjoyed it, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up because you really helped my channel with it. And Axel also wants to say bye to everyone. And yeah, I hope to see you guys very soon in one of my other videos. Bye. Bye everyone. Bye.